गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई निशा शर्मा यूर मैथ्स टीचर टूडे ऑन थर्ड अप्रैल 2020 वी विल डिस्कस एस्टिमेशन ऑफ नंबर्स इन दिस टॉपिक यू विल लर्न हाउ टू एस्टिमेट द नंबर्स टू द नियरेस्ट टेन और हंड्रेड नाउ फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दिस इज द रूल इफ यूर कंसिडर्ड नंबर इज इक्वल और ग्रेटर देन फाइव देन यू विल एड वन If your considered number is less than फाइव there will be no change. First of all, you will underline the tens place, and there is tens place is टू and your considered number is सिक्स सिक्स is greater than the फाइव then you will add वन to the underlined digit. It means first number will be same. And and add one. Two plus one is three, and the last digit will become zero. It means four hundred thirty is the correct answer. Clear, students? In next question, now tens place is one, and your considered number is two. Here two is less than the five, so there will be no change. It means first number will be same. One will remain one, and the last digit will become zero. Clear, students? Next question: Estimate the numbers to the nearest hundred. This is the rule. Considered number is equal or greater than fifty. You will add one. If your considered number is less than fifty, there will be no change. Let's see first question. Two, four, five, six. Nearest hundred. It means you will underline the hundred space. That is four. After that, your considered number is fifty-six. It means fifty-six is greater than five. You will add one to the underlined digit. First number will be same. Four plus one is five, and last digits will become zero. It means two five zero zero is the correct answer. Next question two four one seven. Underline the hundred space that is four, and your considered number is here seventeen. Seventeen is less than fifty, so there will be no change. It means three four will remain four zero zero three four zero zero. Is the correct answer? Clear, student. Now try to solve such type of questions in your notebook. Thank you.